I would say this about TMJ um, treatment in general. Right now, um, there is a movement to uh, try to form a TMJ specialty. Um, while this may be political in nature, um, I think it's one of the worst things that could happen to dentistry right now because physiologic-based dentistry is doing a tremendous job in helping patients with TMJ problems that have never been able to be helped before. It doesn't matter whether you see me or you see anybody else. As long as they are trained and understand how to deal with this problem from a physiologic standpoint, I'm pretty confident that they're gonna be able to get you going in the right direction. I've had a number of consultations with patients who have seen multiple specialties, be it in medicine, in dentistry, so neurologists, ENTs, uh, oral surgeons, um, uh, chiropractors, uh, the list goes on and on. And none of them have been able to help these patients. And they come to us, they're um, really, really in bad shape. I mean, they have chronic headaches every day. They have the ear symptoms we talked about. They have neck symptoms that we talked about. Uh, their quality of life is horrible. And being able to help those patients and get them going in the right direction in terms of managing their pain, getting rid of their headaches, or more very much minimizing their headaches, uh, is really, really gratifying to see. And to see these patients happier and smiling uh, is, is really a great thing. I would just say that wherever you live, um, we're able to find a dentist that's somewhat in your area, even within an hour or two, that has this training that could help you. Um, and I, I think it's quite important because, again, we've seen that there's a number of specialties that have not been able to help these patients, that have treated them with medications and other things that are, again, just kicking a can down the road.